Well, the good news is at the moment, no tropical systems to deal with, but we do have tropical moisture that we continue to deal with these heavy downpours day after day, even though that storm is long gone. What's happened is we've got the stationary front. It's basically right on top of the area and we've got all this moisture that kind of runs up into it and that just continues to spark off these afternoon showers and storms and things tend to be quite heavy when they do happen. So here's your future cast. First half of the day should be fine. We get to lunchtime, a few isolated showers and storms, and then things start bubbling up later into the afternoon. And these showers, once they start popping, will be heavy once again. And the kind of downpours that really fill up the roads with water pretty quickly. We'll see that again here throughout the day. So good chance of rain again today. And boy, we are really stacking it up here in the old rain buckets. 13 and a half inches on the month of June. And we still have a whole other month to go. That's more than double what we typically get in June. Nowhere near a record. 26 inches would be a record. So thankfully we're not getting there. But nonetheless, extreme amounts of rain. You can see the surplus on the year nearly 12 inches, about the same in Pensacola. We had a very wet April kind of in the middle on May and now have a very wet June going once again. So scattered storms likely today. Winds out of the south, temperatures in the upper 80s, so kind of typical for what we had yesterday. I think as we head into the week and things calm down a little bit, still going to have, don't get me wrong, there's still going to be some scattered storms around, uh, but a little bit calmer as we head into the weekend uh, as things start to uh, kind of get back to normal. But nonetheless, just be prepared to deal with some more showers, some more storms. It is June after all.